This is Enerdrive's board G. Suitable for all lead acid battery types as well as lithium batteries, including the BTEC lithium range. It comprises of our Enerdrive DC to DC charger, suitable for both vehicle input charging and also via solar. Effectively, this unit prioritizes your vehicle when traveling and when stationary works as your solar controller. It's a particularly good MPPT solar controller, suitable for receiving a numerous range of solar panel types up to 45 volts input, suitable for up to 800 watts of solar charging a 12 volt system. And here you can see the Enerdrive AC charger. This is the 40 amp option. These chargers are also available as a 20 amp and 60 amp in the 12 volt range. Notice the green button. When your system is up and running and switched on, it lights green. However, for those with a BTEC lithium battery, this is an excellent feature. In the unlikely event that you should discharge your battery 100%, it is possible to switch off the BMS. To reset it, rather than accessing your battery, assuming it's in a very awkward position, you can simply connect to your vehicle, press and release that button in order to reset the BMS within your battery. This breaker is added as part of your solar system. So this breaker is wired directly to the solar input of the DC to DC. It makes for an easier installation, but it certainly makes for a more serviceable system. You can press the button on that breaker to isolate your solar. These boards consist of two main breakers. You will notice the 120 amp breaker there as well as the 200. The 200 is ready to go for an inverter upgrade should you require it. And the 120 is pre-assembled to this bank of fuses here ready for your loads as well as your charging sources. Enerdrive opted for the Cymarine battery monitoring system for this particular board and what sets this system apart is its versatility. Cymarine battery monitors are certainly a popular choice nowadays. I think it's fair to say that is largely due to the versatility of this great display. Not only can we measure overall current, we can measure individual loads via the quad shunt. So effectively you may wish to see your solar input versus how much your fridge uses. Further to that, you can connect additional tank senders. So this display will show you what's left in your water tanks, grey water and fresh water, diesel tanks, petrol tanks if you require it, as well as your overall battery capacity, system voltage and so forth. And better still, you can connect to this device via your Android and Apple devices. How easy are these systems to install? All you need to do is connect your vehicle input and also your solar input to the DC to DC charger. Plug in your AC charger to mains power. Connect additional loads that you wish to itemize independently on the monitor to these spare points on the top two shunts on the right hand side. You have two spare fuses here ready for additional loads and every single negative feed gets connected to this bar work down here. It's a very simple installation. As we started before, you can connect your inverter to the 200 amp breaker. Your main battery positive feed goes on our bolt here at the bottom of the 120 amp breaker. And our main negative feed from our battery connects at the bottom there on that shunt. Run your data cable, mount your display, and then you have it a premium system suitable for any lead acid or internal BMS lithium battery. And a driver thought of everything with this system, ensuring maximum longevity for your battery system.
The Cymarine monitoring system has an alarm function. It is programmable. And you, as the user or operator of this system, can adjust it to suit your needs. It's, pro it's wired to this device here. Now, we're using this as a relay of sorts, a switching device. If you require your system to disconnect your loads at 50% for lead acid batteries, you can do it via Cymarine. If you prefer it to switch off at, say, 20% state of charge for a BTEC lithium system or any other lithium system, you can do it via this system. And if you have certain loads that you wish to be prioritised, essential circuits, you can wire them up to this fuse block here, ensuring that when your state of charge gets down to your determined value and your loads switch off, those priority circuits remain on. Enerdrive have a large range of boards like this designed and manufactured by the production team at Enerdrive in Brisbane, Australia. They vary in size and components, therefore functionality. If this isn't the perfect system for you, I'm confident that Enerdrive will have an ideal solution to meet your needs.